Goa, a divine place embraced in the lap of Mother Nature, is truly God's most cherished creation. This unique southern Indian destination, influenced by the Portuguese culture, is home to beautiful beaches, places of worship, world heritage sites and architecture. It attracts large number of international and domestic tourists every year and is classified as the biodiversity hotspot. With a coastline approximately 102 kilometers long, Goa is characterized by continuous stretches of sandy beaches, occasionally interrupted by rocky plains and headlands. These protrude as far as 2 to 3 kilometers into the sea. During the last two decades, Goa has witnessed a drastic change the face of the coast. The advent of tourism, population increase, coupled with building activities and modern societal demands, has resulted in large scale changes in the geological and ecological setup and has indelibly altered ecosystems, land use patterns, and coastal zone landscape. Heavy construction activity and associated infrastructure requirements of the tourism industry have led to chaotic and haphazard construction sites, which are at the cost of the environment. There is an uncontrolled construction of hotels, resorts, small restaurants and shacks. All these in order to meet the demands of the growing tourism industry. These uncontrollable constructions are located in the coastal regulation zones of Goa. All these violations have had an adverse effect on the aquatic marine animals. Moreover, these violations have impacted the turtle nesting sites, especially the sites at Morjim Beach, Kaljibak Beach and Agwanda Beach. Another major threat to these aquatic animals comes from the garbage being disposed near the beaches in Goa. How do you tackle garbage issues? See, garbage is a big concern for our state because here in our state we find that there are hardly any sites identified by the government where garbage disposal is taken. Like in Penjin, today we are finding we are almost having 80% segregation in form, form of dry and in form of waste metal, wet uh, garbage. But still, having said that, we have got a disposal problem. We don't have a proper site because of some uh, political reasons. But soon it will be solved. So, sir, right now, where is the garbage going? What is the disposal? 
right now we are having uh, small small sites in and around the city and we have got uh, 100 composting pits in different areas where all household garbage wet garbage is taken care by the 100 these 100 composting stations small small so every say every ward or every uh, half a kilometer half a kilometer we have one uh, composting pit so that that area which is surrounding area of the composting pit the all garbage is treated in that area so this is how we take care of household garbage then we have got hotel waste or hotel waste and uh, market waste that's a big problem for us so we have a small plants whereby composting window system is uh, we are operating through we are operating through now recently we are uh, almost on the verge of buying organic waste uh, converters to take, take care and these are all temporary measures we take at, according to times This paradise in earth, which is naturally blessed with marvelous beaches and green landscapes, is under a major threat due to these environmental issues. Thus it's time we save Goa.